Writing for me is simply a mode of communication and I feel like students find the process much less intimidating when they think that way. Writing to me is a way of expressing myself. I get to see who I really am while I'm writing. Writing has always been very personal and important to me and has helped me through many hard times in my life. So the goals of the Sixth College Writing Studio is to provide a space where upperclassmen can provide peer mentorship to underclassmen in terms of improving their writing. The ideal is that uh, first year students who are going through the CAT sequence as freshmen can go to someone who's successfully completed the sequence and who's been trained in writing pedagogy and writing approaches, teaching writing. Um, and get really good feedback from another source. Sometimes first year students can be really nervous about approaching their professor or their teaching assistant and it can be more comfortable to talk to a peer um, in terms of their questions about how to improve their drafts and how to understand the assignment. The purpose of the studio space is to enable these CAT students to take ownership of their own writing process and continue to develop as writers. Yeah, 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 I understand. That's like the sense that I'm getting from these drafts. Um, okay. So let's revisit this later. Again, it's a good anecdote, but um, yeah. Um, let's just, um, I mean, it would be more relevant if, it's you know, better. there are not, if you weren't talking about primarily food exhibits and maybe something that's more relevant. We started out well by talking about, like, the expressions in the two children, their position um, in the lap of someone who's older. But I think that um, in an attempt to kind of incorporate an outside source, you kind of diverted and started talking about Virgin Mary and Jesus artwork. So um, I'm gonna, just going to write focus. Did your TA say something like this? Yeah, I mean, uh, she said like, like the quotes were like, like, they weren't integrated like as mm -hmm. clearly. So. Yeah. So the first step in the writing process is that I ask to read the prompts for the essay that they're trying to write, and I ask the reasons for why they came in today, and then I go ahead and read the essay. And my number one rule is to make sure that they follow the prompt. Other than that, I don't really have any rules because I think that each individual student has their own unique style of writing, and I try to cater my suggestions to that style. And some misconceptions are that we help with grammar, we don't. Um, and also, their TAs grade their essays, so it's relatively subjective in terms of the grading. So I can't exactly give them an A, even if I make suggestions, the TA may not always agree with them. So one of the biggest problems that CAT students have is they don't have a strong, specific, argumentative thesis. So an example of a vague and weak thesis would be something like this. World hunger has many causes and effects. Well, no duh, of course it does. That's not arguable. But another one, a revised thesis that is more specific and more arguable would be something like, hunger persists in Appalachia because jobs are scarce and farming the, in, in the infertile soil is rarely profitable. So now the author can bring up evidence to support these two claims and the reader can disagree with that. Usually students are learning to write in order to get through the SAT, right, or get through an AP test. And that type of writing doesn't necessarily lend itself to like intellectual risk, right, in terms of students really digging deeper into an issue or a question or really wrestling with something that's challenging or a complex. People come in thinking, oh, there are great writers and then there are not great writers. When every writer has to learn the skills, they have to learn the mechanics of writing. There's a lot of pre-writing exercises and outlining 
and learning how to communicate what you want to say. And then there are several layers of drafting before you get to a final draft. I think tutors at cat writing studios are really helpful because they help me with my um, essay structure, organizations, and the content. I think I get lots of improvement. And one thing about cat radio is I think they deserve more attention because this is a great resource besides asking for TA for help. Uh, like students should definitely come to cat radio studio and.